Have you ever thought about how to decorate your space for your videos? Today, I'm gonna to show you some ways to make your space represent you and the content that you create. I'm a video creator and I love cameras. So naturally, my space is gonna include lots of cameras, lots of lenses, and even my dog mochi. Your video should have your identity baked into it. And the easiest way to do that is to decorate your space. Today, I'm gonna to transform my space into three different genres that are common within the creator community. True crime, gaming, and lifestyle vlogging. So where do we start? Step one, figure out your location. Step two, select props that fit your content. Step three, create the space. Step four, light yourself. There's a link down below to a previous episode on lighting. All right, let's go find our space. For your location, are you gonna be in a corner? Do you have a window nearby? Maybe you have a desk or a table that you could use. Maybe you have a bookshelf or a shelf that you could put props on. Whatever works best for you. Keep in mind why you need this setup though. Is it gonna be for your intro? Are you doing a podcast? Maybe this is your main filming space. Let me show you how to transform this corner of my studio as if I were a true crime podcaster. Let's go get some props. What do you have around your house? Depending on your channel, you may need props that reflect your personality or your niche. Do you have inside jokes with your audience? For everything to be cohesive, you may need a theme or a color scheme. So here's my complete set, dog included. There's two basic ways to compose yourself. Either you're directly in the center or you're off to one third of the frame. If you are on the one third, I would suggest adding something on the opposite side to fill in that space. If you're in the center, make sure you add stuff on both sides of you to get a good balance. We've come this far, now we wanna make sure that you look good. We have a previous episode on lighting if you want more tips and tricks, but keep in mind the tone that you're going for. <laughs> for example, this is a true crime podcast, so I have very dramatic lighting on me. Lighting is as important as the rest of your set design. So here are my final looks. A true crime podcaster, a gamer, a lifestyle vlogger. I hope this was helpful. Let me know in the comments below how you design your space. And thank you so much for watching. Let me know what other topics you wanna to see to help improve your video skills. 